Hi, I'm not Tom. I'm an illusion created by you, the observer. Here's me at age two, and now. What if I told you that no time had elapsed between these two photos? This is what I'm looking to express musically while at BPM, and the song that you hear now, Tools Lateralis, is a finger in that direction. Speaking of directions, society takes an infinite, multi-dimensional reality like this and gives us a narrow-minded, blinded path to walk down, like this. So most people never get to truly experience life because they're sedated. That path we're supposed to walk down is interesting because its direction is linear. We're taught the illusion of time, about timelines and the idea of birth and death, but if you observe life itself, nothing at all is linear. It's more like this. Linearity is a reductionist concept, as is time, which is relevant to what we perceive as the third density, but does not exist in dimensions beyond the third. Our language is very linear, which is also highly programmed. An interesting point about 4-4 tempo is that the nervous system readily accepts it and affects our biological oscillators, which makes us easy to program through the medium of sound and music. It's not necessarily bad, just something to be aware of, because all things out in our universe contain light and dark, and as Rumi said, beyond judgement lies a field. This field is where I like to be, spiralling out. Speaking of spirals, check this out. If you've never experienced tube riding, this is as close as you get without getting your eyes wet. Notice the spiralling effect? This is my favourite thing in the world. I also like guitars, pianos, drums and people. I like interesting harmonic soundscapes and polyrhythms, and anything to do with nature, art, and I like girls. It's funny that we're not supposed to say stuff like that, but sexual energy is pure creativity, so pretending that we don't like girls or boys is actually muting our full creative potential, which isn't really ideal as an artist. On that note, I'm not really a musician, I'm a high performance coach and holistic health practitioner, and over the years have reversed serious injuries and diseases that many specialists couldn't treat, which led me to uni. I'd devised a research project that would have helped many people, but the problem with academia is that it relies on reductionist science to prove things. So bringing something new into that paradigm is like wading through a chain of self-protective egos until you get to that eyes wide shut party where everyone's blowing each other over their ability to reduce a hole down to irrelevant bit parts. I did find out about BPM though. I started playing guitar in high school when a mate showed me the intro riff to End of Sandman, then stopped after high school to become an athlete and entrepreneur. But I'm picking it up again because I understand how powerful music can be as a medium for carrying information. I'm kind of shy, so I'm always trying to push myself and try to smile and say hi and remember people's names, even though that's a little scary. I'm running an independent campaign to become mayor of the Gold Coast and will run a podcast from uni covering how the universe works, how the world works and health related topics. That might sound like a lot, but if you really want to do something, you'll find a way and if not, you'll find an excuse. It's also a lot for someone who usually sits on the quiet side of the fence, but that's where BPM comes in, because where words fail, music speaks. Here's something different. This is where I live. I call it here from a King's Mountain view after the Tool Song Jambi. It's pretty awesome, but just to be able to sleep at night, I have a long track up a pitch black path that's kept by juicy orb spiders. It's very intense. That's a joke. I don't like jokes. People often ask me if I'm allowed to do that, referring to legalities. The fact is, the only power anyone has over you is the power you give them. Also, there's no such thing as the law. Imagine how those law students will feel when they figure that one out. I'd love to pass myself off as a rock star, with girls on each arm, fish bowls of coke, and acres of green, but you're more likely to find me in bed by 9pm, spiralling into my own consciousness. Oh, I also speak fluent Simpsons, and my favourite music is silence, because it's where all sounds come from and is eternally powerful. And I like ice cream. See you in the field sometime. Thank you.